Actually, we're in the Barangay 2 boat, which is right next to San Jose and St. York. And this is the Seashell Museum. And I guess this guy is from Oregon, the United States, the owner. And it's a restaurant bar and a museum. So the first you see when you get here are these beautiful flowers. I just can't get over how pretty these things are. But she invited us why we wait to go look at the Seashell Museum. It's a hard word to say fast. Seashell. Seashell Museum. And they've got all the seashells. So if there's any seashell fanatics out there, this is the place to go. Oh, oh, there's a gift shop too. So I don't know exactly what I'm looking at since I am pretty uneducated in the way of the seashell. I just know my wife likes to eat them. Ooh, that one's really pretty. Oh, here they show you. That must be this one here. But it says they're toxic. Do not eat those ones. Venomous cones. Oh, see, they'll reach out and they'll grab you. So, just don't pick up any seashell you find. They might get stung. I gotta say, this is very nicely pres the presentation here. The lighted cabinets. And if you look up, they have what they look like in the wild when you see them in the water. And like I said, there's a gift shop, so I'm in trouble. I will have to be buying my Asawa, a nice season. Oh yeah, how much are they? 250 pesos? Five bucks? Not, not too bad. Here's some of the bigger ones. I don't wear earrings, babe. How about a hookah shell necklace so I can look like a California kid on spring break? Actually, I look kind of like hookah shell necklaces. I know they're kind of, only douchebags wear them, but I always thought they were kind of cool. Wow. Wow, look at these hairy oh suckers. Oh, there's some big oh, ones. Babe, now you guys got conch shells here? Huh? Yeah, we get these conch. Is that a conch? It's not a conch. What do you mean conch? Well, there's a, the thing is a conch shell. That's what they go, boo, they blow into. This but fish. the meat is supposed this to. This one. Well, that's a puffer fish. Oh. They blow into them. But the meat is supposed to be delicious. I don't think I've ever had conch meat. Wow. Well, these puffer fish, huh? That's really good. Oh look, they got googly eyes, like in the movie. See, they put googly eyes on it. I don't know where they got all these from, but someone is in the seashells. <gasps> Here we go. Yeah. Here's stuff I like. Crabs. That's a horseshoe crab of some type. Ooh, look at that sucker back there. Wow, that's really big. Yeah, this kind of looks like a, like a delicious crab. You can see the reflection on the back, the great markings he has on the back. Ah, they are lobsters. Is that what they call a slip lobster? Starfish. Starfish. What else they got here? Sand dollars, which is always fun to find the sand dollar. Fish. Oh, we got some fishies. Ooh, that's, that's the eel. one. That's the one he said. Uh, a, I said that's dangerous, like, like, like. That's a, a crate. Oh. See, I don't know the scientific names. If this were reptiles, I would know. I'm good on reptiles, but. Those here, I think you call those cowfish. Or those ones back there, I don't know. Eels, sand dollars. That looks like a slip lobster. Wow. And stamps that have seashells on them. I guess you have to make your, oh, and even currency with seashells. And what is this right here, babe? 
Is this part of a coral? Doesn't say, or is it the leg or something? I shouldn't touch. But here's uh, more little crabs and crustaceans. Ooh, look at this guy. Ooh. This guy here is in my nightmares most nights. Those are the, the garbage ones. They put stuff on their back. So you can't tell what they are, maybe? Crabs, 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 crabs. Okay, well, that's the guy here. More shells. What do you know? Protected Philippine Aquatic Wildlife. Pygmy sperm whale. Dugong. Lots of dolphins and whales. Oh, great white shark is protected in the Philippines. I've never seen one. Whale shark. Seen him. Green turtle. Loggerhead and the leatherback. I think the guy said he's just a couple nights ago, leatherback was a short laying eggs. He said the big ones and leatherbacks are the biggest ones. It could have been a lodger head. More shells. And more shells. I guess this would be very exciting to someone in the shells. I know what that is. That's my wife. What? Right there. Okay, there's a Philippine eagle. Ah, I'm teasing, babe. You know, I love you, monkey nose. I love you, monkey nose. What is this right here, babe? Is this made out of seashells? Yeah. Ooh, pricey. This would be impossible to get home in one piece. You can buy some. 500 pesos is quite expensive. Stuff to buy. What is that? Oh. It's a. No, oh, that's a shell, huh? Yeah, it's like it's a, a crab or something. It's a forest. And is this some type of serving plate? Yeah. It is a square tray, but why? Oh, they make these out of a shell? Yeah. Wow. Very impressive. Okay, honey. Can you choose me? She's going to buy me a necklace. I don't think there's here anything here that I like, babe. No, babe. Well, I don't, there's nothing here I really like. It's okay, though. You can buy something. Well, maybe something like this. Yeah, okay. This one right here, babe. Babe, this one. Okay. Okay. I'm going to get gifts. Lucky me. And that... Must be the owner. Very cool. So, if you're in the area, if you're on Sikior, and you're obsessed with seashells, or even if you're not, it is uh, free. Probably if you if you eat here, and it's uh, worth a look around. Thanks for joining us. Stay classy.